Hamza Jumaev is not fighting for Sweden anymore. He recently emigrated to the United Arab Emirates and is now rapping them instead of Sweden. Is this pure disloyalty from him or is there maybe some reason and sense behind it? Let me give you my opinion on this in this video guys. Hello and welcome to Bloodsport MMA. Salam alaikum to everyone. So Hamza Jumai fights Paulo Costa in October, October 21st to be precise, in Abu Dhabi, right? UFC 294. And for the first time in his career, he will not have the logo of the country of Sweden on his arm, but of the United Arab Emirates or Kingdom or whatever the precise name is. And that came quite shocking for many people. Also for me, to be honest, uh, at first, because he was always a proud representative of the All-Stars gym in Sweden. He brought the gym to the map after Gustafsson. And he even made me, if you don't know the video, check it out. He even made me go there and train the gym and whatever. He was quite a big representative of Sweden. I also know that the UFC planned on coming to Sweden in that next year or something because of him to make a card there. Now, he's not training in Sweden anymore and he even unfollowed the All-Stars gym on Instagram. Now many people online are talking mad crap about him saying he's being uh, unloyal, this and that, a rat, blah blah blah, this and that. You're a fake lying rat. I, I mean, I kind of understand him in a way. First of all, I don't know the exact motives of him. I don't know if he got paid money for this, this and that, whatever. But what we have to see is, look, Hamza Chumayev did not, was not born in Sweden. He grew partially up in Sweden. I don't know when exactly he moved to Sweden, but oh yeah, I agree that he should represent Sweden because he grew up there in some way, in some, at some stage of his life, they gave him asylum when there was war in his country and everything. And they took care of him, you know what I mean? You should be grateful for that. I 100% agree with that. But at the same time, I feel like the, and I always say this, the only thing in life that is constant is change. And change is healthy. And if you feel like, hey, look, here in Abu Dhabi, this country is closer to my heart, to my religion, because you have to see, Hamza is a very religious guy. And especially Muslims, for them, it's very important to be around people of their faith, of their, that have the same mindset as them. The whole country has the same mindset, the same faith, the same rules as he is familiar with. Sweden is completely different. And I also, from the temperature side, I also agree with living in Abu Dhabi rather than Sweden, you know, but that's just a side note. But if he feels more comfortable there, if so many of his friends and family live there and he has a great gym there that he can train at, why not? I get the loyalty side to the All-Stars gym, 100%. But what you have to see is his coaches are regularly training with him there. His coaches are with him there oftentimes. I mean, I don't know how this will exactly work now with the All-Stars gym because this gym still needs to work and you can't fly out the coaches to Abu Dhabi all the time. Um, but as of what we see from the videos, his coaches are still with him, at least sometimes in Abu Dhabi. And yeah, as I said, look, if, you f if he feels more comfortable there, if he feels like Abu Dhabi is, is better for him, for his life, for his lifestyle and everything, then so should it be. It's not our decision to, to, to question that. It's not, it's not like he was born in Sweden, then you'll be like, whoa, bro, why you changed the country? Like you can train in Abu Dhabi, but you could still rap Sweden. Why you're not rapping Sweden anymore? But I can understand Hamzat in a way that maybe for him, it's just, yeah, Sweden is in his heart. It will always have a place in his heart, but it's not like, oh my God, Sweden is my country. Like I was born there. Um, you know what I mean? He doesn't have any roots there. He doesn't have any family members that are coming from this country. And I completely know why people, or understand why people say, ah, loyal, this and that, especially if you're out of Sweden, if you're a Swedish guy. But I have to say, I can understand Hamzat's side, side as well. If he says, look, especially if they pay him as well, like, why wouldn't you? Like, this country just fits me better. I feel much more home there. Uh, I, I can be with people there, train there. Everything is perfect there. Why shouldn't I train there? At the end of the day, most important is that Hamzat feels happy and good at the place where he's at. 
his career is his career. It's not the fans' career or any, anything or anyone's. So most importantly is that he feels comfortable. If he feels more comfortable there and rapping this country, then so should it be. You know what I mean? So should it be. Could there be political things with the leader of Chechnya? Oh, you can make many theories, but I honestly would not be surprised. And I do believe that he probably just feels better in Abu Dhabi, that this just feels closer to home. And like, if I could choose, I would probably also rather live in, I love Sweden, but you know what I mean? Just from the temperature and everything, and this, especially if, if I would be a Muslim and this would be my people there. And I, like, I, understand, I understand it, you know what I mean? So the unfollowing thing, what you have to see there is, yeah, you unfollow to All Stars Chim page. So what? He still follows all the guys that train there, that you train with, all his coaches, everybody from there still follows them. He just unfollowed the official Chim page. Of course, you could say you shouldn't, you wouldn't have to do that, but what does he gain from still following them if he doesn't train there anymore, but he still follows all the guys from the gym that he's good with? I don't think they had beef or something. You never know if you have any information, write it in the comments, but I don't think they had beef or something. I just believe he just trained in Abu Dhabi every now and then, every now and then, and then it became more and more. He spent more and more time there and just felt like, hey, this is my country to train at and I want to wrap this country now on my t-shirt, uh, on my hoodie or whatever it is. So I have no problem with it. Write your opinion in the comments, guys. What do you think? Is it a disloyal move, an uh, unloyal move? Do you understand why he's doing it? Write it all in the comments, guys. Make sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel. And most importantly, that you can live in Abu Dhabi. Get your sleep in. Until the next one, bye-bye. Blood sport out.